Approximately one month after speaking with Brandon Muff and Abby, I was able to track down Holly Boisvert in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. It took Holly quite a while to answer the door, but when she did, I introduced myself as uh, Detective Martin from Fort Wayne, and I was working on a cold case. The look on her face, she was, uh, she got rather pale. I indicated that I knew that it had been some time. And I asked her if she remembered the party. Nothing made sense about the whole thing. How so? Everybody there, we were all friends. But I mean, you and Stacy had kind of had a little beef going on because of Brandon. It was so stupid that was. It, it was. It, I agree. It was like one of those just petty high school girl things, right? Exactly. Okay. So I know everybody says that I did something to her. I know that they blame me. There were several things that uh, really stuck out to me. First and foremost, she kept referring to Stacy as her friend. She was my friend. We were terrible teenage girls, but she was still my friend and I would never intentionally stab my friend. I would not have done that to her intentionally. I never would have pulled a knife on her. We were terrible bitches to each other, but she was still my friend. I didn't expect that we were gonna fight. Holly admits to owning a pocket knife at the time, saying she carried it around for protection. Do you recall, did you have your uh, pocket knife with you that day? I didn't even have it with me. Like, if it was there, it was in my bag. It's not like I walk around holding it. Have you seen it recently? Do you have it now? And she got up and she went back to a bedroom area. What's crossing my mind when Holly hands me this knife is, one, is she trying to throw me off of what's really happening and where that knife really is? Or two, did I catch her in a moment of weakness and she actually gave me the knife used to kill Stacy? 